morning. We are at Ibero Star Maya Suites outside Playa de Carmen. This is our first full day here, and we're just gonna relax today. Eat, drink, go to the beach, cool day. Yesterday was all day traveling. We didn't get down here till four o'clock. So we're pretty exhausted. We're in full vacation mode right now. Um, we'll bring you guys around to the resort. We'll show you all some of the restaurants down here, uh, activities, they always have something going on. Uh, we have an excursion planned later this week, so you guys can follow along on our journey. But we're gonna go get some breakfast. And I need to go put some sunscreen on. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, the sun is out full force today. Yeah. Not very many clouds. It's a beautiful day down here. I think we're on high of 86 today. So let's just enjoy our day. You hungry? I'm hungry. Okay. All to right. breakfast. We'll see you guys at breakfast. breakfast time we got to start out with a extra spicy Bloody Mary so where you can eat and drink I'm still really full from last night so usually we go to breakfast at the Maya buffet but on the Facebook group they said the Maya buffet had just recently closed um, there's just not enough guests to keep it open so I encourage you guys to go to the Facebook group, join the community page, and you can ask a lot of questions and, uh, and see what's happening down here on the different weeks. It's pretty informative. Thank you, Billy. A lot of complaining too, as you get on social media, but um, there's a lot of information. As you can see, there's a lot of options down here for breakfast. You shouldn't be starving down here. They've got something for everyone. So breakfast is 7 to 11, lunch is 1 to 3 o'clock, and dinner is 6 o'clock to 10 o'clock. And I think as far as the buffets for meals, the Lindo buffet is, I think, the best laid out. They have the probably the most seating, but we'll take a look at the other buffets. I don't want to get too stuffed. You eat it. Maybe some fruit. I'll get some fruit and then we're going down to the beach. See you guys down there. As you walk through the meandering courtyard of the Maya, you can tell so much attention was put into making this place feel like another world. We made our way to the pool that both the Lindo and the Maya share to get a beach towel at one of the towel huts. To get a towel, you'll need to tell the staff your room number and the towel is issued to each person. If you want a fresh towel, you need to exchange it at the towel hut. Before you check out of the resort, make sure you return the towel so you are not charged.
From the pool, you'll find the beach after a short walk through the protected mangroves. This is one of my favorite spots because you get to see the coatis up close. Please do not feed or touch the coatis. They are wild animals and it's in their best interest if humans do not interrupt their natural instincts and survival skills. They can be unpredictable and could bite. Enjoy from a safe distance. There are signs throughout the resort informing guests not to feed the animals. When you get to the beach, there are umbrellas and lounge chairs available, which are first come, first serve. There is nothing more relaxing than listening to the ocean. Give this video a like if you agree. The waves were pretty large with a powerful rip current from a storm that blew through before our arrival. Be on the lookout for the colored flags as they will indicate the ocean condition. If you need a refill on your favorite drink or get hungry, you don't even have to leave the beach. There is a full bar and at lunchtime, the snack bar opens up which you'll find food such as sandwiches, wraps, hamburgers, hot dogs, fries, nachos, salads, fruit, and even soft serve ice cream. Servers will also come around to the umbrellas to see if you need a refill, so you don't even have to go up to the bar. The resort is always offering different activities at the beach, such as volleyball, cornhole, dance parties, and other games. There is also an area where you can get a massage for an additional cost. Water sports are also available down at the beach. Some are free while others cost extra. The free activities include non-motorized sports such as kayaking, catamarans, windsurfing, and snorkeling. Gotta get in this waterfall. Ready? Ah! Uh, woo! Oh, that's cold. That feels good. Alright guys, we got a tube. You can buy them down here in the store, but they're ridiculously expensive. So we end up just buying them on Amazon and shipping them to our house, traveling with them. And at the store, they do have a way to blow them up. So you can blow them up down here. And usually we'll just find people who are looking for tubes when we leave and we'll gift them the tube and they can just uh, share it with the next people. Yeah, there's a lot of people with tubes down here, and if you want to save a bunch of money, just uh, just go buy some on Amazon. This one I think weighs one pound, so it doesn't add a lot to your to your packing. If you just want to lounge around, relax, have a cocktail, this is the way to do it.
Tonight, we decided to go to one of the specialty dining restaurants, La Geisha, which is a Japanese hibachi restaurant and is located near the Maya Lobby Bar. Only Maya and grand guests have access to this restaurant. We have the sushi options, and the whole menu is on here through their app. So two of our friends ended up having too much fun at the pool today. And they're not going to make it. So they're going to either go to the buffet or they can order room service. And I believe room service is available till 11 p.m. Yep. 11 to 11. Okay, so, okay, download the app. Download their app. It's full of information. Chelsea just looked up what room service is. Yeah. It's available from 11 a.m to 11 p.m. so I it was 20 or 7 but I guess I was wrong yeah are you gonna eat with uh chopsticks Let's see I'm so hungry right now I'm I want french stop. fries I'm afraid that we're gonna leave here I'm still gonna be hungry that's how hungry I am showtime yeah My friend! Oh. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh my god. Wow! This is your city! Okay. We've been through. We've been through a lot of hibachi restaurants before. That's, that's so far. He, I think, is the most skilled. Yup. Ready. Hey, so it's my Inga. Inga. Here. Magic soul. I think you're grabbing your arm. How you would be able to tell him. Woo! The white meat. Oh, boy. Are you ready? Oh, God. Yeah, I'm ready. Open your mouth. Yeah. One, two, three. Top. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> that, one oh, more. One more? Yeah. Oh, no way. <laughs> one, two. two. No, tomorrow. Tomorrow. <laughs> Good. Mexican water. My agua. If you ever get a chance to visit La Geisha, we highly recommend it. They have great food, and of course, they're a lot of fun. These are my Walmart pants. I know. It doesn't matter where you buy clothes. No, I, they fit. And I like them. These are the pants where we, I was in Costa Rica, and I jumped on you. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Oh, good. In five. Uno, dos, tres. Go, 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 go. El hombre la va a matar, muere. Cántela. Ahí, dale. Otro. Sit down, buddy. Sit down. Go to the window. Que la está la va a ir, mira, mira. Hey, that's teamwork. Now I see why you guys are getting married. <laughs> <laughs>